Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. If you have to collect a combination of sales taxes that you report separately, like a county sales tax and a city sales tax, you don't want to possibly confuse customers by itemizing the individual sales taxes you collect as separate line items within your sales forms. Many customers may mistakenly assume that they are being taxed twice. Therefore, QuickBooks lets you group individual sales tax items you have created within the item list together as a sales tax group. So customers will see a single sales tax line item amount within their sales forms, while QuickBooks will still report and collect each sales tax item within the sales tax group separately. You create sales tax groups as another type of item in your item list. Note that you must first create the individual sales tax items you collect as items within the item list before you create the sales tax group. After you have created the individual sales tax items for each tax you must report, you can then create a sales tax group within the item list by selecting Lists, then Item List from the menu bar to open the item list window. Then click the Item button in the lower left corner of the item list window and select the new command from the pop-up menu that appears to open the new item window. In the new item window, select Sales Tax Group from the type drop-down at the top of the window that appears. Enter a name for the sales tax group into the group name number field. Then enter the line item description you want customers to see within their sales forms into the description field. Then click into the first row under the tax item column at the bottom of the window and select the name of the first sales tax item that will be collected as part of the group. You can then click into the next row in the sales tax item column and select the next sales tax item that will be collected as part of this group. Repeat this process until you have entered all of the sales tax items that will be collected as part of this sales tax group. When you are finished, click the OK button to save this sales tax group into your item list. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.